I'm ready for the last three games of the title Tuesday. It's not going so well. Uh, if you watch part two of this series, you will realize that my Blitz uh, abilities are not what they used to be. Uh, if they ever were any special, they're really not, not anything special now. Uh, and uh, I uh, just lost two games in a row. So let's see if I can make a comeback. Uh, it's uh, 6.30 uh, here in uh, Denmark and I'm tired and I'm hungry uh, but I'm probably okay <laughs> and I should be able to play better chess than I have just uh, managed uh, to in, in the last two two games um, so overall I lost three games um, and and by the way <laughs> some of the games I won was not that uh, sort of uh, impressive or um, convincing uh, so I'm, uh, I'm not I'm not really uh, but I'm gonna I'm gonna let this video come anyway uh, so you can see how it is to be at 52 year old grandmaster trying to play blitz with young people uh, who play a lot of blitz and they sort of seem to have a much faster brain and uh, better reflexes uh, the one of the thing you you lose when you become older is like uh, you you still know where you of course you probably even know better where the pieces should go but your tactical reflexes just uh, seem to get worse uh, with with age um i don't know it's um it's a little bit uh, depressive uh, to but on the other hand um you cannot expect to be uh, in in the world elite uh, when you're not uh, really working on chess. Uh, and uh, and anyway, there are so many talented young people now that it's it would not happen anyway. Even if I did work, uh, it's 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 too late and I'm too old. Uh, but but I still think I should somehow be able to play a little bit better than I am right now. Uh, so I'm hoping for a complete uh, redeeming myself here in the last three rounds with excellent uh, blitz uh, and uh, instructive games and so on. And maybe I should switch to e4 with white because this d4 is not really doing anything uh, for me, it seems. Um, Anyway, uh, they say next round is starting soon and then nothing happens and I sit here and I talk and I talk and I talk and I talk. Um, and uh, of course, uh, this is what happened. I can tell you that a series chess, I don't know, is, is that uh, Mamadiarov? Yes, Mamadiarov. He is leading with 8 out of 8 uh, ahead of a Polish fighter who's uh, Duda. Hikaru got uh, seven also, and Firusha got seven, and Aronian got seven, and Leon Beast is is Lagrave, yes, he's got seven as well. Uh, Carlsen is stuck on six and a half, and Kramnik also have six and a half. Uh, hopefully they'll play, that will be f the most fun. Anyway, uh, Mamliarov usually does not play that well in Blitz uh, compared to the other really fast guys like uh, Firusha and uh, Marcie Vesilegrav, they are like, and of course uh, Carlsen and uh, Hikaru. The thing with Hikaru is that he's just, he's, he's uh, low limit. Oh, I thought I was going to play this guy and then Polish fighter, that, that, was, that was a mess up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is round uh, round nine, and uh, this is a woman feed master from Azerbaijan. Let's go with e5. That cannot be that bad. Um, probably be bishop c4, I expect. Yeah. And let's see. Okay, and we'll have an Italian game. Okay, we'll not have a real intelligent game. Italian game. So I'll play this move. Um, Maybe I should play this move first. Then this move. Mm -hmm.
I don't know. Maybe I'm losing a bone here. I could take a three. Okay, so I'm not losing a pawn yet. Mm -hmm. Knight d7 maybe, if it's, she takes, I play queen d6, looks smart, tricked her. She can't take because of the pin, I was a little bit lucky, I admit it. Take it. That's a really weird move. I don't get it. It was a mouse slip or something. Of course, I couldn't take it, but it's still a really weird move. Now their plan is very simple: b5, b4, and. Uh, Bye bye, pawn. Okay.
Phew. I guess that was okay, that game. Um, let's see what went wrong. The, she did play some weird moves uh, along the way. Um, the interesting point here was this move, which is really, a, it's, it's like you're making a trap because I can't take it. If I take, then uh, knight takes and it's, it's hitting here. Like something like this is, is, is of course completely losing because uh, the queen has to cover d7. Oops, uh, and uh, and it goes here, then knight is six. Uh, so that was, but that's, that's the only point on bishop f5. So, so bishop f5 is, is a ridiculous move. Uh, of course, white's position is pretty solid, but he's got, he's got some, some weak pawns. Anyway, um, she went back and realized, and, and this, of course, is, is, is very equal. And, and I'm not sure that I like this h4. And um, of course, here we are playing Blitz, uh, the, and, and uh, of course, it, it's nice to have these kind of... And she's, she's keeping making weaknesses, take, take, and b4, and... And I'm not sure I like c3. Yeah, the computer doesn't like it either. Queen goes here, centralize. Um, and queen c2, knight goes here, computer does not like that, and queen b6, queen f3, probably could she play queen b6, c5? That would be in draw. So what she did was this, and this is losing now. Yeah, now I'm winning. So queen c5 would have been a draw. Oh, so it was not it was not that bad. Uh, I, I thought I thought I was uh, I thought h4 was a weird rook f5, but it's kind of position where mistakes are not punished very hard. Uh, anyway, um, it was nice to to win this game, um, and we can see that uh, what's this? Oh, we have other games. We can look Firusha, Polish fighter, one against Firusha. How did black win here? Oh, Ferrucia lost on time. Oh, no, Ferrucia lost on time, but he's also finished against Duda. Duda's dangerous. Um, anyway, I see that um, Lagrave is on 8 out of 9, uh, Duda is on 8 out of 9, and Mamadi Arif is on 8.5. Higaro got 7.5, Svane, Frederik Svane, 7.5, Ronuk Sadvani, 7.5, Magnus Carlsen, 7.5, Asina Move Hit, I never heard of him or her from, I think, is it? Yeah, Iran is uh, on seven and a half also. Uh, and I think I got four and a half or something like that. Uh, but I won that game and uh, we have two more games to go. Hopefully they will be instructive. Uh, you in, in this kind of chess, you meet a lot of uh, different uh, players, uh, like uh, in, in very different uh, skill levels. Uh, uh, the, the one the last game had 25-15 and I uh, played with some and I think the best player I played was uh, was Meyer who's, who's, who had uh, 3000 rating and, and that was a draw but I was uh, I was lucky in that game I guess um, I'm sure he would say I was lucky at, at least um, uh, but we'll see what's what's coming up next round starting soon it's it always says and uh, then nothing happens um, and um, we'll see what's what's going uh, to be. And like I said earlier in the other video, I think playing tournaments is is much better than playing just playing blitz because when you're just playing blitz, you're like uh, there's nothing at stake. I think the tension you get uh, from tournaments makes it better training. 
than just splits. So I think playing these tournaments uh, makes sense. Um, I don't think it's, I think actually working hard on your game is, is a better way to train, but it's not nearly as fun as just playing Blitz, right? So playing Blitz uh, has some, some merit. And of course we understand that Magnus Carlsen just thinks this is, uh, this is what you're supposed to, to do. This is the fun part of chess. Just uh, playing, um, playing, playing Blitz. Uh, I don't know why we are seeing this, uh, this game. Um, I should probably stop it here. So we are ready for the next round and it's starting soon. It has said that for a long time. Um, my guess is that uh, Polish fighter Duda, he will beat uh, Mamliarov now, something like that. Okay, cheer down. Uh, okay, we'll, we'll switch to E4. Uh, we have a lot of D4. We also have a knight F3. Time to, to do something different. Uh, E4 is, uh, is also a good move. And actually, in Blitz is probably one of the better moves because it's very active. Um, and we'll, we'll play just uh, the... Let's see, we'll play this move. He's okay. He decided that there was no room for that. Okay, this is the main line of um, of the, the Italian, and uh, at d five now is a mistake due to uh, knight b three, and uh, so this is is the better move. Um, I believe what they do now is this move, right? Yeah, you can do this move. is to go d4 here. Yeah. yeah, just gonna cover that one. And if it goes root g6, I'm just going to go g4. And that looks a little bit crazy, but it's not so bad. I hope.
This is dangerous stuff. is trapped. I'm, I'm winning now. This night is gone. Threatening Maiden one. Stupid. Oh, come on. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, that was bad. Old man. Old man. Playing to some. I don't know. Trickster. No, that was bad. Let's see. What did I do? So here, Queen H6. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not even winning. Here I am winning. And what did I do here? Why don't I just... That's fine. Okay. So... This move, right? And this move, and this move, and this move. Yeah, come on. Old oh, man, Jesus. Ugh. Oh, that was bad. Mm. This is what happens when you're old and slow. And but okay. Sergo if you Russia. I don't know why we are seeing this. Uh fair. I see games. I oh, no games left. Um so what well, as Siri play draw and um well uh Mamriarov he's still leading, he's leading with nine out of ten. Um 
Vasile Graf got eight and a half. Raunak Sadvani uh, got eight and a half. And Magnus Carlsen got eight and a half. Hikaru is out of the race for first. He's got eight and the same with Firusha and Aronian. Okay, so this is how it goes. Um, and I'm definitely out of everything. And I was I was I was supposed to win that game. That was bad. I was completely winning. But okay, the uh, something went wrong. He got sort of a dangerous attack, but I think I managed to do decently well. Anyway, let's see if I can manage to win the last game and uh, then I'm maybe not losing rating in this tournament. I don't know. Even though my rating is rather low, I think I see myself as maybe 27 something. So this is, is it not, uh, it's not like uh, worth defending uh, really. Um, I don't know, um, it's strange with Blitz, uh, being in shape in Blitz, uh, sometimes it just flows naturally and other times you're just sitting there and you're trying to find the moves and nothing is coming, it's like eh, 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 eh. and and easy lines like the one we just saw here with uh, where I should just give a check and a check and take his rook and, uh, and, and uh, I'm totally winning and I don't, somehow that's just difficult to see. I don't know why, and um, and of course that is annoying. Uh, but it's uh, I think it's the same for for everybody who who is it. Okay, so um, okay, I meant it in more. I'm black against this guy. I am I don't know from where Cyprus. I don't believe he's from Cyprus. People just write something weird like uh, Cap Verde or Cyprus or whatever. Okay, this must be fine. Uh, let's play C5. That's a good move. And then play B6. B6, B7. Um, let me take. Yeah, and he's going to to play Bishop F3. They all play Bishop F3. I got no other plan so to exchange this one. Hmm. Okay. This is very boring chess, by the way. Um, but it's uh, black has no problems. Okay, let's just let's mix it mix it up a little bit. I want to win this game. And this is people who play like this. They are like really simple players. Uh, they just like to exchange everything, and uh, and that's it, uh, basically. Um, so let's see. If we could do this. I'm gonna lose the pawn, or are we gonna keep it? Go back. Queen. We can. We can keep the pawn. Yeah, I liked he came, he came out of the, uh, and he's out of a plan here for sure. So that's uh, the only plan he had was to exchange this one, and now he did that, and I'm already fine here. No problem really. Make this move. Can play c5. Okay, play this move instead. Is that a real threat? No, it's not.
Okay, can I make b5 work? Take, 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 rook takes, rook takes, queen a8, queen c1. That's annoying. Okay, so we don't we don't make it work. Let's just play like this. And now I'm better. I think anyway. It should be better. Okay, can we take that one? Let's fucking do it. I don't like this guy anyway, so let's see. It's just moving. I don't I hate when they do that. So all these pieces are hanging. Take it. Ooh. This is winning. E4 is coming. So, I was happy with that game. I'm sorry I talked bad about the guy. Um, it's just that it's, 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 it's very boring when pl players just play system chess and not thinking, just making the same moves over and over again, and just uh, ho and they know some tricks and, and then it's gonna and of course it's 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 a it's a reasonable way to play chess uh, and it's probably and probably is is the best way for for some players, but it's uh, just very boring and uh, and also it's like uh, really why are you playing if you got nothing to come with except some 
pre uh, the post plan. I don't know. Well, anyway, um, uh, sorry about uh, the, the outburst, uh, but uh, happy I won. Uh, and I think uh, the game was actually a little bit uh, instructive. Uh, the interesting part is here. Um, uh, I'm, I'm basically I'm. Uh, he's slightly better here. This his system is just just fine, but Black has no weaknesses and so on. Nothing going on really. Well, I'm hoping, of course, to play B5 at some point to get a maybe some 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 minority attack, but also to get a, a hit in the center. Uh, play 95. I go back all natural, uh, and this move is of course uh, to disturb his system play. Uh, I'm, I'm hoping to go here and play, push him back with e6, get a normal uh, his heart like position, and he immediately becomes very worried. And and here we have more or less like a real normal uh, headshot position. Usually we have the queen here, but that just runs into something like, like this. And, um, and he again he, he goes to exchange this, but this is not as good as it was because here black has uh, has gotten e6 in, so there's no white squares hold, and I can just go back. Uh, by the way, I remember Matthias Valls once played knight e8 against uh, Vaganian and um, and refused a draw offer because black's position has a lot of uh, hidden potential. We we see and here uh, of course I wanted to go uh, b5, but that's I think not really good because of C5, maybe, I don't know. Anyway, I played uh, net. this cannot be that bad. And here, of course, he's, he's hoping to, to do something here, maybe. So I decided just to go away. And, uh, and, and this is a typical trick where he's, uh, but I, I had seen that and I wanted my queen on B8 anyway. B and here, of course, I wanted to play B5. The problem is, 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 is this trick here? I thought uh, that I could do something like this, but then he, oops, he has queen c1 and uh, I'm losing. I play rook a5 actually. Ah, but there's, there's no reason to do that because I thought I would win anyway. I could win anyway with, a, with quite a play. So I played into this and prepared b5. Um, and take take and um, and he's uh, he's going for um, oh so uh, Mambiarov uh, messed up and Vasile uh, Gra won against the head of uh, Magnus Carlsen and um, uh, unfortunately for Mambiarov he uh, lost the last game. Anyway, uh, this was a GM talk with a video of. Um, well, let's just see this. And here, this position is, is sort of interesting because I have this move here and I'm winning a pawn. It looks a little bit dangerous, but it's nothing serious. And, um, well, it is winning, uh, I think. Okay, uh, this was uh, GM Talks and uh, GM Talks on YouTube in the title Tuesday. Uh, I didn't do very well, but uh, there were some instructive moments. I hope you enjoyed this video and please give some feedback on if you like this format in the comments. Uh, thank you.